Hello, my lovely kids. Smile three. Unit seven, lesson two. Read much and say how many years ago? 25,000 years ago, people lived in caves. About this time, they started to count. They drew symbols on the walls of the caves to help them. 5,000 years ago, Sudanese and Egyptian people built pyramids. They used math and numbers to calculate how to build them. 2,000 years ago, the Indians invented a symbol for zero. 1,000 years ago, the Arab invented new symbols for numbers one to nine. We use these symbols around the world today. 500 years ago, European invented the symbols for plus and minus. Eight years ago, European and American invented computers. Computers use only two numbers, one on and zero off to make the other numbers, pictures, letters, and words. Yeah, our new words today, 100, this is the 100. 1,000, this is the 1,000. Cave, cave. This is the cave and this is the cave and all are caves. Wall, wall. American, American, European, European, Egyptian, Egyptian, Sudanese, Sudanese, Indian, Indian, plus, minus, true. Yeah, I can draw uh, this picture. True is the past of draw, draw. Built. This is past of the verb built. Symbols. Symbols. They are symbols on the board of the cave. Invented. Invented come from the noun invention. Yeah, let us to start. 25,000 years ago, people lived in a cave. That means for 25,000 years ago, people live in these caves, not in a house. They live in caves, okay? About this time, they started to count. What is the meaning of count? Count means one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. They can count now from one to nine, yes? People about this time start to count. They drew symbols on the wall of the cave to help them. They drew it, the symbol like this, symbol like this on the wall of the cave. 5,000 years ago, Sudanese and Egyptian built pyramids. Okay, we know the meaning of built. This is the past of built. The Sudanese and Egyptian start to build pyramid, uh, pyramids, okay? They use maths and numbers to calculate how to build them. What they are used in to help them in building uh, or to build the pyramids. They use math and numbers. Okay, math. This is a subject like what, like uh, geography, Arabic, and numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. They are numbers. 2,000 years ago, the Indian invented the symbol of zero. They invented zero. This is the zero. Zero before one. 1,000 years ago, the Arab invented new symbols for numbers one to nine. Yeah, before 1,000 years ago, the Arab invented these numbers one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. From one, from one to nine. We use these numbers around the world today. Until now, we use these numbers. 500 years ago, European invented the symbol of plus and zero. Plus and minus, sorry. Plus and minus, okay? One plus, uh, plus one, it is equal to two. One minus one, it is equal to zero. 
Yeah, this is a plus and this is minus. 80 years ago, European and American invented computers. This is a computer and they invented this computer before 80 years ago. Who invented the computer? European and, and American. European and American. Computers use only two numbers, okay? In the computer, we use just two numbers. One as on and zero as off to make the other numbers, pictures, letters, and words. That means what? If I want to make anything in the computer, I will use just these two numbers, one and zero. One as on and zero as off. Change the sentence to correct to correct sentence. Then say, yeah, number A, people live in a house 25,000 years ago. Okay. Is it people live in a house before 25,000 years ago? No, people lived in caves, not in a house. This is number A. Number B, European built the pyramids 5,000 years ago. Okay. Is it Peruvian? European built the pyramids? Let us do 5,000 years ago, Sudanese and Egyptian people built pyramids. That means no Sudanese and Egyptian which they are or who built the pyramids, okay? Number C, 2,000 years ago, Americans invented zero. Let us to know who invented zero. Yeah, 2,000 years ago, the Indian invented a symbol for zero. That means what? No, yeah. Uh, Arab invented, sorry, 2,000 years ago, American, no, uh, the Americans not invented the zero, the Indian invented it, okay, no Indian invented it. Number D, Arab invented new number symbol 250 years ago, okay, Arab invented symbol for numbers one to nine, when? before 1,000 years ago, before 1,000 years ago. Also, here we can say no, Arab invented numbers of uh, symbol, numbers symbol 1,000 years ago, not before 250 years ago, right. Number E, Indians invented the plus symbol 500 years ago. Indian invented the Bilas symbol 500 years ago. Okay, this is Bilas and minus, and they invented it before 500 years ago. Uh, European invented it. Let us to know, is it European? Indian invented, no, not Indian invented the Bilas symbol. Yeah, the European do that, yeah. No, European invented it. Number F, people invented computers 100 years ago. Yeah, where is the computers? Let us, do, yeah, this is a computer 80 years ago. European and American invented computers, okay? Yeah, people invented computer 100 years ago. No, they invented computer or American and European invented computer before eight years ago. Yeah, in this lesson, we can get some information about the past symbol. Yeah, the past symbol for the action which happened in the past. If anything happened yesterday or yesterday uh, or the last week, last year, we use past symbol to speak about it. Subject, Bilas verb, Bilas bus, uh, Bilas verb in the past. Yeah, this is the form of this verb. As example, yesterday I went to the market. Yesterday I went, to the, I went to the market. If I want to go to the market, now I will say I am going to the market. I go to the market, okay? But if I speak about the past thing, I will say yesterday I went, not go. Went, not go, okay? Yeah. The first, the second example. She visited me last night. 
if I speak about uh, this day, I can say she visited. But the last night, that means this is past. This is a past. I can say she visited, not visit. Okay? I will use the verb in the past. We have different kinds of uh, verb in the past. Regular or irregular. Yeah, the regular verb, which the uh, regular verb in the past, which is end with ed, like what play, played, dance, dance. Look, looked, okay? And the irregular verb, which is the past forms have lots of different ending, not ed, okay? Like what run, run, read, read, see, saw. Yeah, we have here an example for the regular verb, answer, answered, answered, ask, 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 okay? Uh, compare, compared, compared. Uh, play, played, played. Need, needed, needed. Okay. Uh, a lot of, a lot of verbs. And here we have some, some examples for irregular verb like say, sit, go, went, come, came, no, knew, go, get, got, give, gave, become, became, find, found, think, thought, see, saw. Okay. We finished from this lesson. I hope you are understand this lesson. Uh, see you at the coming lesson. Have a good day. Goodbye.